Hey vlog, so it is 2.30, I'm about to head out. It is very much a rainy day, so I'm honestly pretty shocked that I'm even getting out. I usually stay home when it's this disgusting out. I figured if I put on a cute little pink outfit that it would make me want to leave a little more. So today I just made my coffee, got ready, and I'm about to head out to my sister's place. Next week I am going to Europe, and when I get back my sister is going to be moved even more south. She's going to South Miami. And I'm just gonna help her pack, so I'm gonna head to her place now. I just wanna take advantage of the time that I have with her being a little bit closer, because if you guys don't know, I live in Pompano and she lives like 20 minutes south of me. I don't really know what we're doing. She was texting me some ideas, but I know she wanted help packing. So I'm definitely gonna be doing that. I thought I'd bring you guys along with me during this nasty, nasty day. I'm sure you guys can even like hear the rain right now. And whenever it rains like this, it just reassures the fact that I need a vacay and to get out of Florida because this weather is just not a vibe usually. Also, you guys, look how cute this bag Logan got me is. For like Valentine's Day, it came with the Ariana Grande perfume. So cute! So I'm gonna head out and pray that there's no traffic. Yeah, so let's go and figure out what we're doing with the day other than packing. Literally. What? Ooh, no, I can't even go to the sink. <laughs> it's making me scared. So I just got to my sister's house and I completely forgot the fact that she's fostering a, a, a snake. <laughs> like, I, like, it makes me feel like there's creepy crawlies all over my body. She's bigger now. Oh, don't, let's not. She just let's not add detail. That's what Where do you put the skin? It's over there on the napkin. Oh, I thought it was going to be a mouse on the napkin. There is on one Oh, one. let me not get and curious. Sea frosting and then the scales. Yeah, um, she was like, oh, look at the sink. I was like, oh, I'm going to stay right here and not do that. This is Nibbles and this is my cat Pumpkin's mommy. And they literally meow the same exact way. Are you hungry? No. I was gonna ask you if you wanted to go to um, Girl, Cali. I was waiting for you to get We can go somewhere to eat. I don't care. The taco place? Yeah. Sure. Yup. I'm just making the mouse defrost because it's um. Defrost is crazy. <laughs> yeah. They're frozen. Is it like. I mean, I need to like open spot? this. No, it's okay. Together. I don't care too much to see it. She's around here somewhere. How big is she supposed to get? Uh, she could get up to four feet if it's a female. Oh, great! About your size. Yes. <laughs> mm. <laughs> she was over here, so I was able to see her. She had her like belly up and everything. It was really cute. Yeah, no, I'm so sure. I'm sure it was like Look, super. Like I'll if you wanted you. to cuddle. Where are the kittens? That's what I wanted to see, not the snake. Oh no! Nah. With the red eyes? No. No, no, no. Where are the kittens? Here. Oh. Oh. I see one, I see two, three. That's Yogi. She's such a good mom. Yeah. Oh my god. He's so cute. Stop, you're just a, Oh, this one's just a little bumpkiss. They like hop up and then they claw. Wait, who is, who is this? She, he, she's very, very munchkin -y. That's Winnie. I love oh, her. Winnie. She's my favorite. Oh. From... She's such a baby girl. Oh my god, wait. Munchkin. She's a cutie. A beauty filter on or something? No, ma'am. It's just smooth. No. What is it? I don't have anything. <laughs> the, the other. <laughs> Why are you like upset? I'm not upset. I'm not. I just. It looks smooth. Thanks, babe. This is the La Roche Posse. Actually? No. Four. It's probably my LED face mask. You be I, doing that? Yeah. It helps. Logan got me one for my birthday. It helps. I think so. I had this gigon gargantuous nose pimple that I woke up with, and it was so foul. The red light penetrates the most, apparently. And um, I have so a red light for my snake cage. Probably would work the same. Uh, it's UV. I don't know. I had giant pimple, and I was like, this is not happening. So I washed my face, did the red light, put a pimple patch, popped it, pimple patch gone. So, not so quick as I got rid of it. I think it works though, I just use different colors. 
What do you, what were you asking if it would help it? I have like broken capillaries. That's, that's why I started doing it too, because like, Did it help with I have, um, I think so. I gave it like a little break just cause I forgot and I was like doing other stuff and I was like working late. So I didn't feel like putting it on, but I did it cause I feel like my skin's really like fair and like I can kind of see little things sometimes. And I remember in Spain, remember when we go to the facial place? Yeah. I remember once they did like laser on it. And the, um, it helped me personally so I much. I can't, my... I know it's like you have to do multiple sessions for Sorry, that stuff sir. sometimes. Please look I definitely recommend the UV because I don't think it can do any harm. And may as well. just got home probably like 20 minutes after i went to her place we ended up going out and we got some quesadillas and burritos and i'm very full from that so i think that being full and this weather is giving a sleepy combo she also gave me so many chocolates <laughs> because apparently she doesn't like chocolate because um she doesn't understand so i am definitely going to be demolishing these in a little bit i still have some homework that i have to get done for before my trip i really want to shower and wash my face i feel like whenever i wear mascara i love it look wise but it just always i feel like after hours irritates my eyes so much i don't know how to stop it from doing that also there's like fallout i think it's because it was raining out i think i'm honestly just gonna chill watch some tv and do some skincare because i was remembering my led face mask and i should probably do it to have my skin as nice as possible for next week i want to get cozy but i want the room to be organized for when i'm cozy to like put a candle type of vibe but it's not like that so i have to like organize and not be cozy to get to my cozy space so maybe that's what i'll do oh, that doesn't sound appealing but I think it's what has to be done. did my red light therapy and i was just hanging out with logan and his friend that he had over we were just chilling i luckily knocked out some assignments like i was hoping to i think in a few minutes logan and i are actually gonna head to the atm because i wanted to deposit some money and then i need to get some gas because i have an appointment tomorrow so i just want to have that all set up to not be worrying about gas and tomorrow nero has this many plans I love how he's so trusting, you know what I mean, like, he can do quite literally anything if he's asleep and he'll be like, okay, yeah, no, that's fine. He's so cute. Also, you guys, I think I have an unhealthy obsession with bad reality TV, and when I say bad, I mean, like, yelling at each other, foul, like, like, how do I explain that? Like, always yelling, stupid drama, repetitive drama, I don't know what it is, it's been having me in a chokehold, and I think it's just because... I can't find any other shows that are good right now and I've watched all of my other stuff but I literally went through Floribama Shore. I tried Jersey Shore and then I wasn't like zoning in. I finished Floribama Shore which is like 26 episodes in a very short span and I wasn't paying attention completely to the episodes like it'd be background noise sometimes but still a little like a little too quickly and now I'm watching Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. And that also has me in a chokehold. And it's a lot of yelling. Sometimes I'm like, mmm. 
but Nero doesn't mind it, so we're gonna keep watching it. I switched my skincare routine a little bit before I used to use the CeraVe and Cetaphil moisturizer, but if you guys have the app Yuka, you know, but if you don't, it's basically like you scan barcodes of products and it lets you know if it's good for your skin or not. Yuka was not giving very good reviews about the products that I was using, so I switched to La Roche-Posay, which had really good um, like scan reviews. So far, so good, and I've been doing the face therapy which i've also been liking a lot i definitely think that it makes a difference but it's obviously also a thing of consistency i'm gonna head out to the atm and then i think i'm honestly gonna go to bed because i'm gonna wake up early tomorrow to get my day started bye